Welcome to Tom's Hardware US, where we provide in-depth reviews and helpful tips. Today, we're taking a look at an intriguing piece of upcoming technology from Intel, the codename Panther Lake. This is Intel's latest integrated graphics unit and CPU architecture, revealed by an Intel graphics hardware engineer on LinkedIn before quickly pulling the information. But don't worry, we've got the details. The 8th will be based off Intel Z3 Celestial GPU architecture. At the moment, we don't know too much about this architecture, other than that Panther Lake and the associated integrated graphics processor will be released several years down the road after Intel's Meteor Lake, Arrow Lake, and Lunar Lake are released. The CPU architecture will utilize Intel's upcoming 20A manufacturing process. This process is set to arrive in the second half of 2024, and will be the first node to enter the Angstrom era, where physical features of a chip can no longer be accurately measured in nanometers. Intel's 20A process boasts a brand new transistor architecture called Ribbon FET, and a new transistor wiring technology called the Power via Interconnect. This promises some decent power and performance gains compared to the current Alder Lake and Raptor Lake architectures. We can expect Intel 20A to offer at least a 15% more efficient performance per watt than Intel 3. And what about the integrated graphics processor, IGP, for Panther Lake? Well, once again, we don't know too much as of yet. Intel will be using its Celestial GPU architecture, which has been developed additionally for discrete GPUs, in its integrated graphics solutions, so we do know that. So, to wrap up, Intel's Panther Lake looks like it could be an exciting piece of technology on the horizon, if all goes according to plan, we should know some official specs by Intel Architecture Day 22. Stay tuned for more info as this story develops. Thanks for tuning in to Tom's Hardware US. If you'd like more information like this, don't forget to subscribe and follow us. See you next time.